Hey guys, thanks so much for clicking on my video. My name is Jess and today I'm going to be doing the five minute makeup challenge. So I'm actually just gonna be running out the door to Target and I figured I have a spare five minutes so let's give this a try. Um, before we get started though, I would love for you to hit that subscribe button. I'd love to have you back. I have videos out every Tuesday and Thursday and I do videos on beauty and food and outdoorsy stuff so I have a little bit of everything. Um, so definitely hit that subscribe button. I'd love to have you back and we can hang out some more. All right, now let's get started. Okay, let's get the, that's the calculator timer. Okay, five minutes, five minutes. Okay, there it is, there it is, ready? I'm very nervous. Okay, ready, set, go, go, okay, it's on. All right, let's start by priming the eyes. No time to put lids back on. All right, so I always, 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 no matter what, if I'm doing any kind of eyeshadow, I have to put eyeshadow primer on. If I don't, um, it always creases. I was using the Tarte uh, Mermaid palette the other day and I forgot to prime my eyes and uh, the look did actually crease on me by the end of the day. It didn't look bad, but it was there. Um, just putting some base primer on too, because I do get an oily T-zone. On my cheeks too. Okay, let's get a eyeshadow brush. I'm just using the Naked palette. Put some Naked up on her. Just want a little bit of definition. Just have a little something something. I'm gonna take the tiniest amount of buck and just put it in the very outer part. Just drag it in a little. Ooh, that wasn't too much. I feel like if you only put naked, you don't get like a lot out of it. So having buck in there too really makes it. Okay, that. Uh, Go in with some under eye concealer. Okay. And beauty blender. Blend that all through. Oh, I feel like I can't catch my breath. This is so stressful. I don't know how people actually do this if they actually like if I actually only had five minutes to do my makeup and then run out, I probably just wouldn't even bother with it. Like I definitely wouldn't. I know myself. That's this is too much stress for very little payoff. <laughs> Just using that Cody Airspun Translucent to set that. And I'm gonna use a powder brush. Just do the T-zone too very lightly. Oh man. I've seen some of these and some people can really do a good job. I don't think I'm one of those people. Oh my gosh, I have less than two minutes. Put it on. Um, a mascara. I'd really like to put on some bronzer and like contour, but I don't know if I have enough time. I don't know if I should have even bothered with the lower lash line because this is far too stressful. Okay, good enough. Oh my gosh, I have a little bit more than a minute left. Let's let's do some bronzer brush. Okay. If I have more time, I will try and contour as well. But I would just like to get a little bit of color on my face. 
45 seconds. Oh my gosh. Uh, I'd like to highlight. Where is my highlight brush? I kind of think I used the wrong ones. I'm so stressed out. Oh gosh, less than 30 seconds. Let's do this. I think I used my setting brush because I have the same one for both of them. Oh my gosh, 15 seconds. I think I used the wrong one. 10. I don't have time to contour. I don't. I don't. We're good. Not too shabby. There it is. Five minutes. Whew, that is stressful. I if people actually only take five minutes and like do it this fast and stressed out, I I couldn't even imagine. This is like my heart. It's just pounding. This is too much stress. But that being said, I actually think it turned out quite nice. It's like not bad at all. I am very happy with this. I am gonna go out to Target like this. So I think it's a pretty good job. I would have liked to have like an extra minute to you know, maybe just contour a bit and I mean lips like whatever. I'm just gonna I'm good with just chapstick So but I mean, I think it's pretty good. What do you guys think? Leave me a comment down below Let me know how I did um, but With all the stress of it. I have two of these real technique setting brushes uh, Yeah, it's just called a setting brush. So one of them I marked one of them I use for my under eye concealer with the translucent powder and then the other one is for my highlight but I think with the stress of everything, I just, I think I used the wrong one for each one. So, oh well, I might have some shimmery under eyes. I don't know. I'll need to wash these. I mean, it's probably about time I wash them anyways. But overall, I'm pretty happy with the look. I think it came out quite nice. Not too shabby. I mean, I already have naturally rosy cheeks, so I didn't need any like blush. Um, that's why I chose this one. It's by Benefit. It's Dallas. So it's like this really nice like... I don't know it's almost kind of bronzy rosy but it it's like a two-in-one I feel like you can use it as a bronzer and it kind of gives you a little bit of like and it's got like some shimmer like a very slight shimmer so you got I don't know I really like it I thought it was good for this type of challenge um kind of like a two-in-one blush bronzer I would like to contour it but that's all right I think it's not too bad I'm actually happy with it I'm gonna go out to Target like this so let me know what you guys think I hope you enjoyed this video if you did please give it a thumbs up and please subscribe to my channel I'd love to have you back all right guys take care bye